17th Andre, you have brought us amazing standout fashion statement pieces and been such an inspiration in the industry. So in terms of going forward and your partnerships, why did you choose People Tree? It was a wonderful challenge. People Tree presented a challenge that they were going to take me to India, make sure I was exposed to all the different factories that they were using and I could actually see how it was all going together. So it was quite inspirational. And seeing how their founder, Safia Mini, works. You know, she's a very good taskmaster and she follows everything she believes in. So it is fabulous. I went to India with the model and this lovely Spanish filmmaker and a makeup girl so that we not only had the original samples that we then got photographed in situ, but we could be shown how they were all working really well and how it was all going. People Tree do all this wonderfully ethically correct fabric and the, all their, the way they handle everything and so they approached me to do a very small capsule collection. I've been very, very thrilled with it. And this happens to be one of them printed with my jungle trail design and it's lovely, lovely smooth cotton. And I was on the stage with my people tree dress and my jewelry from Adele Marie. It's been very nice. Tell us a bit about your handbag collection. And we've got a whole lot of wonderful variety. This one, for example, has got the two different textures, which really looks lovely. From tiniest of little tiny beautiful handbags, computer bags with the shell stitching on them, and even little cat and dog carriers, some with wiggle lines. You can be very smart carrying your doggy around. I think they're going to have to make several sizes. You could have an elegant chihuahua in a handbag size. Do you think in fashion we have a responsibility to shop, not just based on aesthetics, but also in terms of maybe being more culturally aware of where things come from? I think we should be more responsible and think about what what it is we're wearing and all the effort and the number of people it takes to go into things. I think it's something certainly worth considering. Do you have any style icon? Most of my icons are people from the past like Scaparelli who has influenced Machino or um, Chanel who I think had enough of a strong look that Karl Lagerfeld has very cleverly developed it but I just hope that I will become an icon in myself and then I won't have to worry about answering that question. Well, you absolutely are an icon, Sandra. Thank you so much for your time. <laughs>